All systems are go to the 2019 New Year's Day Junkanoo Parade after officials from the parade management team were given the all clear by the Department of Meteorology today. Junkanoo Corporation of New Providence Chairman Silbert Ferguson says he expects a smooth parade after the setbacks which marred the experience of Boxing Day. Ferguson says those issues which were not a part of the committees were not under the committee's control have been addressed. What happened in the streets flowed over in, into the parades. And so uh, it was unfortunate, but we have made every attempt now to um, make sure that all the containers that come into the parade tonight, they are gone by midnight to the east side of Elizabeth Avenue. We should have had a smooth parade boxing day. Unfortunately, we had that hiccup, and that really caused us to go south. Uh, but hopefully, um, uh, our guests could experience a great parade. Uh, for the New Year's Day Parade because we're going to make sure that none of these things hinder these groups uh, from making their way in, into the parades. Now the New Year's Day Junkanoo Parade lineup will also be a little different after three Junkanoo groups pulled out, among them two A groups. We have had um, the official uh, word that has come now from the music makers and the prodigal sons that they will not be participating in the New Year's Day Parade as well as the body of Christ. They will not be participating in the New Year's Day Parade. We have just advised all of the groups, uh, wherever they are, that they'll move up one or two notches. And so uh, in the event of, of the um, Saxons who have number seven, they will now be number five. And so all the groups will just move up one or two slots just to cover uh, for those two groups that will not be here.